while we're waiting for the pot to cool off we're going to preheat the oven to 500 degrees and we'll repeat that same experiment alright we're going to start the time for three hours um, going to be just a minute before we get completely started cooled off the pot got another bottle of water out of the same refrigerator same half liter fill that all up and we're preheated to 500 degrees now so I'm going to open up the oven and we're going to place the pot inside the oven and we're going to let that go for a while we'll be back in a little bit and check that progress we're at about 17 minutes and I'll show you what's going on in the oven that's what's happening right now so we'll keep going As you can see we're at about 28 minutes now and here's the progress there's a couple of bubbles coming up and we'll continue on as you can see we're right at an hour and although we don't have a boil going we do have less water in there so we do have evaporation going on and we'll continue to let that go it's an hour 26 and you can see we've got a lot less water again we don't see the boiling but we do have evaporation going on we're at one hour 50 minutes and we're getting really close I'm gonna check it here real quick and show you I'm gonna grab the pot and see how much water is left Hopefully you can see there wasn't too much left in there. shouldn't be too much longer and we'll be all done. Hour 57 and we're getting really close. You can see what's going on here now. I'll zoom in just a little bit. You can see there's just a little bit of water on that right hand side. Okay, we're a minute, or excuse me, an hour, 59 minutes, and it's just about done. In fact, I'm going to help it out just a little bit. Here you go. Well, that was perfect timing right at two hours.